The Metropolitan Police is facing another allegation of racism. A black firefighter claims a group of police officers assaulted and tasered him because of his race. Edric Kennedy McFoy says he was arrested when he tried to help six officers during a disturbance in Harrow. Well, uh, Aisha Baksh has more details on this. Aisha, first of all, what did happen? Well, Mr Kennedy McFoy claims that he was driving through Harrow when he spotted somebody throwing a rock against a police van. Now, he says he approached a group of officers who were dealing with a violent disturbance outside a party. But he says when he tried to talk to the officers, he was insulted, uh, dragged out of his car, tasered and then arrested. Now, uh, Mr Kennedy McFoy is a part-time model. He's a fireman but was off duty at the time. He's also uh, been trained as a police officer. He believes the way he was treated... Um, was down to the colour of his skin. So after he was uh, tasered, he was then arrested? Yes, that's right. He was charged with obstructing a police officer uh, but was found not guilty following a trial. Earlier today, we spoke to his solicitor. The situation that my client has had to suffer has been horrific, um, not just in terms of the force that was used upon him during his arrest and subsequently being locked up in a police cell for many hours, but then having to face a prosecution where if he'd been found guilty he could have lost his job and it would have ruined his life. And this is just the latest in a series of allegations against the Met, isn't it? That's right. There are now 12 uh, allegations that are being investigated uh, by Scotland Yard and the IPCC of racism by Met officers. This is the 10th case to be referred to the watchdog in just three weeks. Earlier this week, let's not forget, Commissioner Bernard Hogan Howe said he will be driving racism out of the force and will get tough on any officers that are racist. OK, Aisha, thank you very much indeed.